no news, nothing, and pure technical analysis. We have been recommending a buy on crude oil since seventy dollar levels, and we have been discussing that it may try to form a symmetry and achieve higher highs. Precisely, crude last week has achieved eighty three dollar levels. I hope you all profited. Now, what to expect next week? Are we going to look forward to a pullback from here, or is it going to show again a strong bullish momentum? Which position you should take trading crude next week? We will see with the help of charts followed with indicators, and towards the end, I will give you the trading strategy and the levels to trade for. Do watch till the do like, share, subscribe, and comment, and also press the bell icon, which keeps you updated with the twice a day analysis, which I share for crude oil. First with the Asia and Europe session, and next with the US session. These two analysis definitely helps. in your day trading decision so do watch both also you can remain updated with the market moves by joining my free telegram channel the link is mentioned in the channel and video description now let's start first we look into the weekly charts here and if you look at the weekly charts here at this position you can see symmetrical formation it has achieved almost the same levels you can see this is a great resistance zone and this time again oil has already achieved 83 dollar levels before closing the week at around 82.4 and yes till 83.5 it has got great great resistance and beyond that it can continue with see in fact i will say 83.5 84 this till 84 it has got great great resistance and beyond that it has got lot much of ground to cover further on the upside till towards 88 92 levels but right now yes for the week it has achieved higher highs it has achieved 83 dollar levels now if you look at the momentum here you can find out see it is trading in this bullish channel and see once again one more beauty to note is that on the downside 78 79 zone again proven out to be a great support it is Touch seventy eight point five and have bounce back. If you recall, in our last week's analysis, we have discussed these levels here. So oil is trading in this bullish channel, and now the highs of this channel are at eighty five, and the support is now seen at eighty eight. Is going to be a very very good support. Also, one more observation here is see oil so far was trading in this bearish channel. Now I'll tell you. Why we have come up with a buying entry? We have discussed this. See, multiple lows were aligned with this, and this time, if you look at, see, the price has failed to achieve the bottom of this channel, and hence we have seen a recovery. Now, also, this is also the median of the channel. It has breached past the median of the channel, and hence now it is looking forward to achieve the top of this channel, which is right now at around ninety-two point five ninety-four levels. you can see this is the crossover junction here this is going to be the achievable target and a great great resistance so the possibility for oil to achieve these levels exists very strong we have discussed this in our previous analysis as well and again i am recommending once it stays above 85 we are going to look forward to more bullishness do not think it off as bearish as of now yes there are supports it can retrace possibility exists however still i will not take it as bearish till the time it respects now 76 and 75 74 zone 74 76 is the base case for now even if it tries to retrace a little on the downside now let's have a look at the daily charts on the daily charts also similar observation see how how beautiful it is to you know when things go as per what you predict and what you expect see precisely bullish run here retracement then run a slight retracement and you know why this retracement was there i will tell you when we come to the indicators this also we had expected that it can possibly retrace till towards the 20 period exponential moving average precisely it has done that now see the last two candles here first of all these three candles lower highs lower low and then this candle has appeared which is a breakout candle now this is break breached on the upside achieved the top of this channel almost at around 83 levels and have closed the week at 82.4 now the next candle once it stays above 83 just stay long you are going to look at similar size of body here which is almost 79.5 to 80.5 2 dollars of move so 82.5 to 84.5 so it can potentially take it till towards 85 dollar levels 84 dollar levels in the first trading session itself there is a very strong probability for it achieving the highs at around 84 85 possibly that could be the time from where it may try to retrace achieve the lows somewhere here in few trading sessions till 80 and then bounce back so this is how it is going to trade it appears on the downside one thing one must note see these levels are definitely very very good support first at 78 then 77 
very good support and in fact as i said till 74 i will not treat this as bearish yes it has come till towards the next resistance at 83 i will wait and watch how it behaves at around 83 and then 84 levels very very good resistance existing now this is purely on the daily charts let's have a look at the monthly on the monthly charts see after staying bearish for a while after taking the support from the bottom of this channel now it has breached past the median also and now looking forward to the top of this channel remember after a bit of consolidation the previous candle was a first bullish candle this candle has almost started flat and it has already formed a tail and it has resumed its journey on the upside now look at the previous candle almost from 72 80 1 82 levels almost 12 dollars of move and even if you count half of this it will take it till towards 788 and almost 70 percent or even 100 percent rise till here will take it till towards top of this channel which is at around 92 93 yes we can expect a second bullish candle in oil from here you have to be alert cautious watchful on the sell side do not treat this as bearish if it breaks past above 85 do not treat this as bearish it is going to achieve higher highs first target at 88 next at 92 93 levels will get definitely achieved take your positions accordingly but now let's have a look with the help of indicators are the indicators are also suggestive of sell now see indicators on the monthly charts now moving average is uh, it has taken a good support from the 20 50 100 moving average now with the support from the 20 period moving average it is trying to rise here again see previously prices were divergent it has converged here taken the support and now again looking upwards stochastic rising looking up here the MACD was trading bearish so far it is willing to converge and a crossover here now see first wave second wave done and it is the beginning of the third wave this will lead to oil prices remaining elevated for next few months be careful here i am warning you again oil prices may remain elevated for the next few months we can in fact expect it to hit 100 110 levels also right now it is looking bullish it is looking upwards hence Yes, also it was trading with divergence, it has converged. I will definitely wait for the crossover to make a more precise prediction. Right now, it is only trying to converge a bit. RSI has retraced a bit. Coming to the weekly chart, on the weekly chart, see the 50 and 100 crossover is about to happen. The 20 period moving average is also now looking upwards. Good signs here for the bulls. Possibly a crossover I will wait for and then the bullishness will take over. The bulls will take over from there and possibly we may see more rise in oil right now taking the support from the 1500 period moving average at around 78 we can see oil prices rising the stochastic on the weekly charts is overbought it can sustain these overbought levels for a while the MACD has traded with divergence and bullishness and remember the MACD is sitting at bottom here it can continue with the rise for a while from here be watchful hence we are again going to stay bullish in oil RSI rising coming to the daily on the daily charts the moving averages have crossed over here trading with divergence trading bullish the 50 and 100 also crossed over also one important point to note is this see we have discussed one point in our previous analysis that prices are divergent from the 20 period moving average it can potentially converge till towards these levels it has converged for once now again looking upwards so it can again achieve higher levels at around 84 85 and then retrace a little wait for the moving average to come back till towards 80 or 82 zone and then retrace till towards 80 82 levels later so this is one probability which one can expect stochastic has dropped here if you look at the macd is still divergent and bullish now this uh, calls for a probably probable chance that it can converge crossover for a little sell and retracement but but before that i do expect it to achieve higher highs before it looks over to retracement here rsi overbought and it has cooled down now again trying to look back on the upside so we have seen the charts we have seen the indicators time for me to define the trading levels and strategies so that you can trade profitably next week and before i provide you the levels if you want to learn this art of trading you should join my mentorship batch 24th batch is going to start on 7th of August. Only a couple of seats are left. Register yourself now itself. Reach out to me for more details. My telegram and email IDs are mentioned in the channel and video description. Also, you can be part of my signals channel where trading as per the signals, you can definitely benefit.
reach out to me for more details on same now first is where to buy i will recommend you to buy here at 82.6 levels beyond this we have seen 83 first resistance then 83.5 and then 84 till here almost every half dollar you will find a little resistance here till 84 if it stays above 84, I will look forward for it to break past by 85 and above 85, just stay long. We are going to look at 86.7, 88 as the next target and beyond that, it is going to hit 92 in the near future. You have to just keep holding the positions above 85 levels. On the downside, where to? I will recommend you to sell here at 81. 81.8 levels but then on the downside 81.4 81 very very good support at 81 exists you have to be cautious of this then 80.2 the next strongest support and below that 79.5 79.5 78.5 78 these are some of the strongest support levels on the downside only and only if you see it trading below 78 you can expect that there is little more bearishness and we are going to look forward to a further fall till towards 77 the next strongest support i do not see this breaking below 77 but these are markets anything is possible any news any worst case scenario it can probably drop till towards 75 74 is still i will remain bullish i will still buy more accumulate more and expect it to rise again take your positions accordingly Trade with a stop loss, trade with a trailing stop loss. Do like, share, subscribe and comment. Do press the bell icon. Join my mentorship page, join my signals channel. Reach out to me for any of your trading or training queries. My telegram and email IDs are mentioned in the channel and video description. Thank you very much. Have a great profitable trading week ahead and a great happy weekend. Thank you.